This is Paul Gordon of State of Wake, uh, reporting on the latest goings on with the Bastille terror attacks. <laughs> and I'm looking at the website RT right now, and we can see a little timeline here. The first, the uh, there were reports of hostages, and now the, uh, the the French Interior Ministry has denied that there are any hostages. Obama makes a statement. The president has been apprised, apprised of the situation in Nice, France. Right, he's been apprised after he just made a speech and was basically he said that these kinds of things only happen in America because of our our, our our laws where it makes it so easy to get guns. Remember, France is, is all but uh, a, a gun-free zone, which, uh, by the way, uh, folks with guns love gun-free zones. And I should say bad folks with guns, folks that want to do bad things with guns. They love gun-free zones. So here we see a picture of the truck itself. We see the ambulance here. I do not read French. Somebody wants to tell me what French means, so uh, you can uh, email me at uh, paul at stateofwake.com. Here's some some raw footage uh, from RT here of some folks running away. The lucky ones, really. The ones who got away. Uh, we see more French stuff, and uh, me not being French, uh, cannot read it. The president of Nice has said over 70 people have been killed <coughs> in what he's called the worst tragedy in Nice's history. More French stuff. 73 people so far are being reported dead. The mayor of Nice <coughs> told... Uh, BFM TV that the truck was loaded. This is a key part. The truck was loaded with weapons and grenades. And here is footage of the truck. And you can see here the truck going through. <coughs> terrible, terrible. Now, of course, we have Donald Trump weighing in, and we don't really care about Donald Trump weighing in. So it's becoming more and more apparent, and, uh, and this is the headline, the trucks used in attack loaded with weapons and grenades. It's becoming more and more apparent. There appears to be uh, two uh, people, <coughs> a driver and another gunman. They plowed through a crowd, and then the uh, gunman uh, got out, another man got out of the, it looks like a big dump truck of some sort, got out and started shooting uh, the other people. And this is, again, in a gun-free zone where the bad guys were able to get guns because bad guys can get guns. You can't stop. You just, you just can't stop it. So remember what I said in the first video that I made today. Uh, the government that wants to take guns away from you is not doing it for your protection. It's doing it for their protection. They want to protect themselves against you. This is Paul Gordon of State of Wake. If you like this video, be sure you like, share, comment, and above all else, please subscribe to the State of Wake channel where you will get all types of videos dealing with true liberty. In this case, we're covering the breaking news story, and we are covering it from a liberty perspective.